2010, another close game. Yeah, it was, uh, but to be honest, we're, we're very disappointed. Certainly in our first half performance, I thought, um, watching the tape when I got uh, got in last night, you know, Lee just wanted that little bit more, which uh, probably isn't acceptable from our point of view. Second half was better, but you can't afford to give good sides a lead like we did against Lee. Yeah, you just said it was a great way to start the second half. Great try by Danny Hill. Yeah, it was, and uh, it's, you know, Danny was quiet in the first half along with Bob Bezit, but I think the, the more times Bob Bezit got his hands on the ball, the, the more effective we became as a team and made a fantastic break from his own half, and, and Danny was there to support it. And you know, I think we, uh, we, we should have kicked on from there as well because we had the uh, ideal opportunity then to, to get Lee on the back foot, but our real discipline and our inability to keep hold of the ball let us down, so it's something we need to improve on. Obviously, Mark Smith got sent off. Uh, was it hard going after that? Yeah, it's always hard going you lose from the last Smithy. I think uh, probably a little bit harsh to get sent off. I think he did hit uh, Ian Watson slightly late, uh, but I think it, uh, it probably looked worse than it did looking on the replay. Um, he's actually caught him on the chest. It's not uh, Smith is not a malicious player, and hopefully the discipline will reflect that. So obviously a defeat is a defeat, and now it's Barrow next. So how important is it to win this game? Always important to bounce back straight away. We're, we're lucky that we've not got seven days to get back on the horse and, and try and get a win. We've got a couple of days recovering now. We've just done uh, the rehab this morning. Everybody's in uh, a little bit down, as you'd expect from a performance like that yesterday, but there's only one way to put that right, and that's to, to get a good win against Barrow. Okay, Steve, thank you very much. Thank you.